He had a hammer in his pocket. That's like a massive... Two hammers in his pocket. It's like a massive no-no if you're in a jail cell. Boxing glove? Handcuffs? This guy is so guilty. Hey Simleys, it's Deligracy here with part 19, I think, of Let's Play The Sims 4 Twins. I've been mucking up my episode numbers heaps lately, so I'm sorry if... Uh, if I get it wrong. But anyways, we had a makeover. Oh, no plants need tending at the moment. Okay, talk to plant. Just keep talking to that plant. Um, yeah, we had a makeover recently in the last part. So Esmeralda has a few different looks. We have the wedding to be planned. And I was kind of wanting to put it off until the new stuff pack comes out because some of you guys were saying that it would be really cool to use some of the new glamorous things that we have in it. I think that would be really cool. Um, anyways, I don't think we need these cribs anymore now that the kitty winkles have aged up a little bit. So I'm just going to get rid of them straight away. Uh, Lionel, how are you going over here, big boy? He's not actually big at all. He's really skinny. His work get up is just really just a midlife crisis. I don't know why you wear those things, Lionel. We'll change you. What are you eating? An excellent garden salad. Oh, he must have learned a bit of cooking uh, since Arya hasn't been cooking for him as much. How about you go to the loo, take care of that. And, uh, oh, Luna, enjoying the solitude. Oh, I love that. I love it. Okay, Esmeralda's gone straight to bed. Okay. What's Niles up to? Niles is in Laurie's bed, which is a little bit strange. So let's get him to go. Uh, into his oh oh look who's in his bed his son oh my god this is like such a heartbreaking moment because he has to wake up his son and be like you can't sleep there and if you guys haven't watched the other parts this is his son but he and Esmeralda the mother of the children they are telling Lionel they're his kids um because Lionel has lots of money so yeah Lock and silver? yeah Lock it. Oh, this is the saddest moment ever. Um, maybe we can... Can we hug it out? Can we hug it out? Maybe just ask about school quickly. He's probably not allowed to really talk to the boys much. Um, but anyways, it is one in the morning on a Thursday, so I'm pretty sure these kids need to go to bed. Their bedrooms are up here on the mezzanine level. Um, so we might put... I think we'll put... Thorn in this room. A lot of you guys said Thorn looked like Where's Waldo in his first attire I gave him. Oh, and a lot of you guys want Arya's bedroom changed up a little bit. I thought her bedroom looked really nice. I was liking this change for her, but a lot of you guys think she is more into the pastel, traditional kind of colours for a girl's bedroom. Uh, and where's Laurie? Laurie's still at work. And I cannot believe how many of you guys were hating on like hating hating on Laurie's hair um short hair don't get me wrong some of you guys liked it but so many of you just could not stand it and a lot of you guys were referring to it as the Miley Cyrus hair so I was thinking you know we might change it up a bit in this part um just see what other options we have okay so they're asleep they're asleep they're asleep Lionel is just <laughs> enjoying time on his own but he should go to bed with Esmeralda Esmeralda will totally change this entire bedroom too, don't you think? I reckon she would. Let's speed things up a little bit. Um, get them all into baddie buys. And uh, when Laurie gets home, how is, she, how is she actually working? Okay, she bought $91 home today. Where's she at? Um, so she's... Doing pretty well. She's got her mischief skill up. She needs to ha needs to have some mischief interactions. Can the, mis the mischief skill do anything to objects in the house? Let's turn that off because that's just wasting our bills. Not that we have to worry about bills too much. Like, can she booby trap anything? No, I wish she could. Um, mischief interaction might be getting a voodoo doll. Maybe. Uh. We could order one off her computer. Let's let's just get rid of this plate. I don't like that there. Um, yeah, let's order a voodoo doll. 
Whoa, it's so expensive. And let's see what we can do with it. Place in the world. Okay. Put an inventory. Bind to. Can only be bound to nearby non-child sims. Okay, so if we bind it to Esmeralda, does that mean we can just do really weird stuff to Esmeralda? Make her feel awful, I don't know. Uh, we might get her to have a bath. And after the bath, she can maybe change up her appearance a little bit. I love this screen though. I'd love to have a bath behind a screen. It's so like nice and private. And little does she know that belief that watery bit downstairs is the under, but the under basement, the under, whoa. Oh, cat's like, where are we going? But it's just going into cats. What I was trying to say is through that little bit of water is the underground cell where Esmeralda is going to lock up someone. Um, a lot of you guys didn't mind the idea of, not that one, that actually looks really pretty though. Um, it was, you guys didn't mind the one that came with get to work, not this one. I'm actually really not a fan of that hairstyle, uh, at all really. Just go short hair. Oh. Look at that little glitch. That's unusual for Sims 4. That's very unusual. Is that because I have, I've used custom content hair for the first time? I love this hairstyle. I quite like that on Laurie. Uh, she grew her hair out a little bit. The buns are a little bit cute on her too. The one I'm thinking of is the bun on top of her head. But maybe we can grow it down into a bun for a little while. Like into this low one. I love this hairstyle. Let's see. Oh, she's going to have short hair for everything else. Damn it. <laughs> um, I'm finding that really weird. If that is from the custom hair content, that is a reason why I don't like putting custom content if in my game if it's going to affect the normal content in the game. Oh, that's quite pretty too. Okay, so she cut her hair short for a while. <laughs> it was short lived. And now she's got um, a few other hairstyles to wear. Cool. Does that mean, oh, that's cute. That's really cute. Um, it just doesn't make sense if she has short hair for half her outfits. Just go like this for a lot of them because that's just easier. Oh, I love the bun idea. Ooh. She could be wearing one of those fake buns on her head, so. Ooh, 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 where's... So like those, um, what are they called? Do you know those buns that are like foam? I have one. It's pretty cool. Should she get another tattoo? Maybe at work she got another tattoo. How do we get to... Do we have to go to Kaz full... Uh, full mode Kaz. Okay, maybe not then. Alright, so she's got a few different hairstyles now. Hopefully that uh, is good for you guys. I don't know. I don't mind her short hair. She might have short hair again. But I feel like she's the kind of person who would change it up quite regularly. And also, if you guys can hear the rain outside my window, it's actually a really nice rainy day. You know how sometimes there's really grey days and people are like, oh, the weather's so bad, but it's actually really nice. Sometimes I enjoy being outside, inside, because um, it's all cozy. I wouldn't enjoy being outside. Pretty girl, pretty girl. Okay, all right. She's really energized. Um, we could troll the forums. Oh, we'll, we'll let her have a bit of fun. Have something to eat and some fun. School for Thorn starts in our... It's our first day of school, I think. Oh, First day of school. Eating cereal. And then he'll need to use the toilet. 
Uh, let's get Born up to. <laughs> He's like, I'm gonna pee my pants. <laughs> okay, so there they need to... What? That like went up and then down. Maybe get something quickly to eat. Esmeralda will want something to eat too. She has a really high cooking skill. Oh, also, if you guys didn't see the makeover, Esmeralda had a breast augmentation. She's got some cans now. They've definitely grown <laughs> since the last part. It was so funny because so many of you were saying, oh, Lionel, she get a butt implant. <laughs> I don't know. Let's see if we bind the... If we bind it to Esmeralda ShamWow. Oops, I wonder what we can do to her. I don't get it, like what do you... Is there a voodoo interaction that comes up? Declare enemy. Yes. Declare... Wait. Oh, she's already... Okay. Oh my god, Laurie. She's like so evil. Now can we do anything? I'm so confused. Wait. Oh, do video. Okay. I was very like unsure about what was going on there. Let's see what happens. She's doing evil voodoos to Esmeralda. Try to chat. I'm not going to try to chat. I want to declare her as our enemy. Find common ground? No. You know what? Let's just be mean. Just yell at. And then we'll do a few mischief skills. We'll scare her. We should invite her to a fake party to get her out of the house. <laughs> Laurie, that did not work at all. Maybe we stop preposterous rumor. Judy calls the world is a never ending. Okay, yes, let's go to work with Arya. Because we need to get Arya, I don't know, to, to level up in her career. But. I don't, I don't really get the voodoo thing. So different ways you like tickle the doll or different ways you treat the doll, it will do different things to the sim it's bound to. I think I need to look it up a bit. Training day two, train harder. There's still a bit more to learn before you're ready for your own case. First, it's time to get out into the community and start building your reputation as a friendly prosecutor. Oh, friendly protector. <laughs> friendly prosecutor or hardened authority figure after that you'll get to take a shot at finding and arresting a subject a sub okay oh no I, i'm missing the clues i'm just oh no <laughs> Arya has discovered that the suspect is wearing a tank top and is wearing slacks and is male i missed the first clue damn it Okay, we can get something to eat first, though. Hey, everybody at the station. Let's look at Arya. She always looks really nice in her officer uniform. Aww. She looks awesome. She looks so cute. She's the most glamorous officer. And she's feeling pretty good about it. Okay, eat up, girl, and then we are off to go on patrol. Oh, hey, friend. What up? Okay, how do we go on patrol? Oh, there we go. Just click the board, right. I wonder what these guys are up to today. I want to wear this outfit. Like, I want to wear the more business-looking outfit rather than the officer one. All right, so we need to find a guy in slacks. What are slacks? Like tracky ducks? I don't even know what slacks are. I thought slacks were pants. I guess that's what it is. Okay, when an officer is on patrol, they can get to know the community and help keep troublemakers in check. Talk with re residents to make a friendly or mean impression. If you see anyone littering or fighting, 
issue a citation to make sure they obey the law. Let's just see what's going on around the neighborhood. Maybe if we go outside, something will happen outside. What's going on down here, ladies? Is there trouble in paradise? Come issue citation. Sure. There we go. <laughs> we don't know what you did, but you just, they're probably doing a drug deal down here. They're wearing matching skirts. I mean, who does that? Who does that? And she just looks like... She just looks not trustworthy. Ms. Ms. Hollins. I think this is a simile's creation as well. <laughs> She's like, but I didn't even do anything. <laughs> and we smell. Oh, no. Ha <laughs> ha, that was fun. Can we issue a citation to you? No? Okay, return to police station. Return to the police station. I want to go back. <laughs> when you're ready, click on your sim. Oh, right. Oh my god, it's awful that she's stinky at work. So bad. So what does this mean? We're going, we're going off to find the suspect now? Looking for new wall art, try the microscope or observatory to get some beautiful prints. Ooh, 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 <laughs> I'm so excited. A suspect fitting the APB description has been spotted in this area. Ask around to see if anyone can point you towards the suspect. Use the notebook to review the suspect description before you make an arrest. Okay. Open notebook, there we go. Okay, so it's a loner, they're wearing a tank top, slacks, and they're male. Alright, well, whilst she's going to the toilet. Aha! This kid! Oh no, that's not a tank top. Where's the suspect? So it's most likely this guy. Who we fought in the first place, Leighton. So I guess we'll just. Let's ask this chick, because she looks like she would know. Diamond. Ask about. Le <laughs> Let's just arrest Diamond. I'm sorry, but I can't help you. Oh, come on. You're probably. You're probably like his sidekick. She's like, um, I'm looking at you. Stop playing chess. He's about yay hi. It's probably Gavin. Gavin is secretly a drug lord. <gasps> he pointed over here. I just saw someone like that over there. Ask about suspect. I mean, it's obviously this guy. There's no one else in slacks or anything around here. I just saw... You guys aren't telling me anything. You know what? Let's just arrest him because I don't think it's anyone else. Excuse me, you are coming with us, Leighton Wetzel. Let's arrest him. I'm so excited to make our first arrest. It'll be really awkward if it's not him. But no one's giving us anything. <laughs> that was really fun. <laughs> Oh, Arya, you're so badass. My god. All right, how did we go? Now that you learned about workout in the world, you should know that there's plenty to do around the station too. Run criminals through the booking station, take crime reports, and get to know your co-workers. You can also use the gym upstairs. All right, can we put him in the jail cell? Did he get put in jail? Did he get put in jail? He's not even in jail. Oh well. Uh, okay, so search criminals at booking station. Is it uh, search search criminals? Is this the booking station? This guy. Okay, work's nearly up, so we'll be home soon. Ooh. Fun. Excuse me, sir, but we're going to have to search you. 
Never trust a man with a man bun. <laughs> nah, I love a man bun. I'm just kidding. <laughs> he had a hammer in his pocket. That's like a massive... Two hammers in his pocket. It's like a massive no-no if you're in a jail cell. Boxing glove? Handcuffs? This guy is so guilty. You know what, mister? You need to be locked... Oh, we'll get your fingerprint and then we're going to lock you back in your cell if we have time. Something tells me we don't have time. Woo! Yeah, we earned 480 simoleons, which is actually pretty good. Uh, you really need to, like, just chill out, girl. Chill out, girl. Esmeralda is just... <laughs> They're still where we left them. Laurie, I've gotten to the stage where you just need to have a quick meal. Esmeralda, once you've eaten, we really want to check out that plant of yours. Oh, and the boys should... Instead of watching a movie, um, Max, can you please do your homework? And then you should do your homework too. Oh, he's spending time with his son. And they both have glasses. So sad. So, Ari, what's up close and personal from searching a subject? That's good. Oh, gosh, she's such a domestic goddess, Esmeralda is. She's been planning this for a long, long time. Okay, so we have the spliced garden shoot from a snapdragon. I think someone actually said, oh, take cutting. Yay! Yes! Okay, so I don't actually know how we do this graft. Ah, here we go. Snapdragon. Ooh, what's this? <gasps> Strawberry, dragon fruit, and snapdragon. Yay! Talk to plant. I think that's how we do it. Um, but I might leave this part right here. I'm really excited for the next part. Oh my god, Lionel! That's so awkward. She's like, ah, oh, I'm just doing a little bit of gardening. It's just uh, strawberry. Strawberry plant, normal strawberry. I'm not hiding anything. <laughs> he goes, oh, you're making giant strawberries. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, what's that in the background? I didn't know we had a tree over here. A wild cherry tree. That's so nice. You should go uh, harvest that. And get a sample. I love it how he just comes out with his tea. Although he looked totally suspicious about this plant just then. He really did. He's like, hmm. Lionel suspects some fishiness going on here. Yeah, he's got the gardening skill. Slide sample has been added to Lionel's in inventory. He can use the microscope item to analyze it. This one? What's a microscope? Do we have a microscope? I don't understand. I didn't think there was a microscope. Oh, this one. Yeah, right. We can just pop that over here and quickly analyze it. I know I said I was finishing off the pot, but I just got excited about this. Ooh, um, this can be his, like, inventions area. As well as Esmeralda's. I mean, Esmeralda probably chose the worst spot to create a cow plant. We'll probably need to move it somewhere less obvious. Maybe in the basement. Ooh, that's cool. Oh my god, that's so cool. Imagine how much that would cost in real life. Like a million dollars. Hundreds of thousands of dollars. I think we should put the plant downstairs. Actually. A print of his discovery is in here. Oh, 
Oh, cool. Awesome, we got that blue painting. Uh, photograph. Here we go, we can put it on this wall here in the lounge room. Oh, nice. Why can't we put it there? Oh, BB dot move objects. I always get this wrong. BB dot move objects. Should be able to just put it on the wall now. That's lovely. What's this? Oh, that's cool. Oh my god, I've never actually seen these ones. Can you even get these in By the Bug Mood? I don't know if you can. I know you can get the orange one in there. Um, just going to rearrange these a little bit. Just put that there, that there, that there. Definitely suits his home to have heaps of uh, like sciencey, spacey stuff around. He has so many cherries. Eat a cherry, Lionel. Eat a cherry. Anyways, uh, we should probably put this plant just before we finish this part. We'll put this plant downstairs. Yeah, because we want to have like an underground cow plant. How cool will that be? We should put it and have it here so the girls can see the cow plant growing and they'll be like, no. Cool. Awesome. Uh, anyways, I'm going to leave this part right here. I hope you're having a lovely morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you are in the world. And I look forward to speaking to you soon. Bye.